No surprise here. New research shows that distracted driving has become an epidemic, and that same research puts Virginia at the top of the bad list. But as Peggy Fox reports, Maryland and D.C. aren't far behind. We're constantly seeing people drifting in lanes, and when I look over, it's always they're on their phone. Just how bad is distracted driving? I definitely have done it, especially when I was younger. I tried my best not to because I see other people do it and it causes such a hazard on the road for other cars and for yourself. When a driver is glued to their phone, they're more distracted, more dangerous, and more likely to cause a crash, says State Senator Scott Suravel. You know, it's pretty selfish behavior. It puts everybody else at risk and in danger. And the road safety company Zen Drive puts Virginia number one for distracted driving. Maryland is 10th and D.C. ranks 17th. Both D.C. and Maryland have hands-free driving laws. Virginia does not. Despite Suravel's many attempts, he did get a ban on texting while driving. So basically under current law, you can chase Pokemon, you can play Angry Birds, you can... Um, read a tweet? You can read a tweet, you can read Facebook, uh, but you just can't send email or text. And so the current law, the police have basically found to be completely unenforceable because they can't figure out what people are actually doing. And if they pull somebody over and they just say, I was looking at my phone for navigation or I was changing music. Regardless of the law, Zendrive found distracted driving a growing problem everywhere. Zendrive says there are super dangerous distracted drivers that they call phone addicts. Phone addicts touch their phones four times more than the average driver, taking their eyes off the road 28% of the time. Zendrive calls them public enemy number one. And the reality is, is that the number of collisions, deaths, all the, all the, the, the money, money, money we're having to all pay for this is going up exponentially every year. We pay for this in our car insurance and it's costing all of us, not just lives, but money. In Fairfax, Peggy Fox, WUSA 9. Zendrive reports this is the largest distracted driving study to date. They collected data from drivers looking at the frequency and the duration of phone use behind the wheel.